Good morning, you guys, and welcome back to our channel. Welcome back to Florida. Welcome back to our special spring break vlog. If you guys have missed any of our prior videos from the week, make sure you go check them out. We have been having so much fun with my cute sister and her darling family, and today is going to be awesome. Boy, do I have a surprise for Jared up my sleeve. Speaking of sleeves, I don't know the sleeves on right now, but I do have on a swimsuit, and you may notice it has our logo on it. Quick little side. I know Jared we have been working on some merch as you guys know so we've been getting some of the samples in and this is the one of the things he designed it's a really cute one-piece swimsuit and it has our logo and JB merch and it fades stay tuned we will let you know when we will be releasing some of our really fun summer merch I think you guys are going to love it. back to today so as you guys know my sister and her family are here for spring break they rented a rental car so we have two cars and today we had planned to go explore Miami maybe head down to the Keys because Jared and I live here I was like you know what we need to kind of change this up I want to do something fun because you know there's a lot of driving involved in that and there is one thing that Jared absolutely loves he loves convertibles throughout our marriage that is one thing Jared and I love to do when we're in tropical places is rent a convertible or a Jeep because I just feel like it really helped make the driving part fun of the experience so my brother-in-law Nick told Jared that his rental car has not been working right so we need to come and swap it, and we are gonna surprise Jared and it should be so much fun what's up you guys hey, everyone welcome, welcome back to our channel today welcome back to our channel we are here in Florida and we are heading actually to go pick up a rental car mm -hmm. because the one Nick and Tiff currently rented is not working. They use an app called Turo and so we're trying to find it in a parking lot right now. What car is it? It's Camry. It's a Camry? Yeah. I think it's this one. I think it's that one, babe. Wait, what? Maybe. <laughs> yeah, I think they rented this one. <laughs> Wait. Or did we rented this? <laughs> we got a convertible for the day! What? Yep! <laughs> go see, go see if it's unlocked! What? Go see if it's unlocked! You got this for us? I sure did! <laughs> Isn't it gonna be fun? You guys look at his face! <laughs> oh my gosh, heck yeah, baby! Oh! oh it unlocked! Like Kelly's back in business! Babe, I was telling them, I actually opened the vlog earlier, so you guys probably see two openings in this, but I told them how we always rent these. The first time, what, five oh, years ago out yeah. in Hawaii, we rented this. We rent them all the time, California. So it's only fitting that we rent one here oh in Florida gosh. for the day. This is so <laughs> cool. That's awesome. Oh, you hear that sound? It's us, baby. Yeah. Come on, let's go. I haven't talked too much, though. I'm sorry. Oh my gosh. So cool. <laughs> He's so happy. Oh my goodness. That's awesome. Babe, okay, this, this is awesome. This Thank is you awesome. Okay, we just got the key box unlocked. You want to do the honors? I'm still a little shocked. I'm the one driving this. Oh my gosh. Oh, oh yeah. There we go. Oh, look at that, babe. Nice. We got him, you guys. We got it. Who's ready to go to Miami? Woo! Both Nick and Jared are drivers, so we will be switching off for sure. But this is going to be so fun. Drive it on the freeway in this thing, it makes traffic fun. It was so fun. These two were great sports. They were holding on to the back of their hats, but they almost blew off, huh, guys? It was so windy. It, it was, was fun. windy, but it's fun. Now we are heading to Brickle, part of Miami, yeah. and we're really excited. We've never, we've both been down here one other time before. Yeah, we've been down here a couple times, but like never really had to like kind of explore and tour around. Yeah, so we're excited. We're gonna go head to some food trucks. Everyone's hungry for some lunch, but this is, I mean, just look right in front of us. Look at these huge buildings. You got the tram that goes by here, which is awesome. And babe, I think this is the way to take in the city. This is a good surprise. Who thinks we should get this bad boy? You guys. Who would like a tour? What do you guys think? You guys come to Fort Lauderdale, who would like a tour in this? Yeah, huh? speaking of that, so many of you did comment on yesterday's video and said, yes, we should do tours yeah. in Fort Lauderdale. Who knows, we will see, uh, but that could be a ton of fun. Uh, Alright guys, 
guys, we officially arrived here in Brickell at a famous food truck roundup area, which is awesome. Tons of food trucks here, tons of parking, and it's free, which is awesome. And what's even cooler, turn it around, look Booyah. at this. Booyah! Check this out, guys. Look where we are right now. This is downtown Brickell in Miami. It is just so beautiful here, There's right like up against the water. A river walk right here, all the food trucks out there is the ocean. That is so cool. On the way here, we passed where all the cruises are, but this is awesome and the food looks great. Amazing. By dinner, I mean lunch. <laughs> lunch. <laughs> lunch was amazing. <laughs> lunch was awesome. Now, that we ride in Mustang Sally. That's right. But now we are turning over the keys to this guy. This is his. White knuckle the whole time. <laughs> <laughs> this is their first time down here in Miami, so we want them to get the full experience. We're gonna be heading towards Key Largo, so Nick and Tiff are gonna take the convertible down that way. I think the are the kiddos going with you guys. I think they're going with you guys. Oh, they're going with us. Oh, <laughs> lucky us. <laughs> Unless Get you don't free. want them, we can take them. Oh, want. we'll take them. We will see you guys down in the Keys. talking to all of you I right now. I think we need a convertible just for vlogging purposes. Jared really wants a convertible. Just for vlogging purposes. We just for vlogging yeah. purposes, we may need to purchase one of these. We've you actually know. always talked about getting a convertible, but being in Utah. Especially a Mustang. Yeah, okay, I think this is the parking lot. Oh, do not enter there though. So we're not gonna enter in there. Anyways, you guys, we are super excited to be here. We are just pulling up to it and hopefully we can see some awesome fish and have a fun day here. All right, all right, we are about to go snorkeling. Bella is up first, Bella and Nick. They're heading out there. Heading out there, the guinea pigs. Go see if the snorkeling's any good out there. It's really calm here. It's kind of buoyed off as you can tell, so you can't go beyond that. What we found, if you do come to the Keys, is most things require you getting on a boat and going out. So yes. That's why there's a ton of like snorkel tours and things like that. We usually go out with Captain Mark, as you guys know, to Alligator Reef. That was our plan for today. However, the winds were too strong. He said he could not make it out there. So sadly, we're not out on a boat with him today, but that's okay. We decided to come down here and check out the Keys anyways. But I feel like one of the biggest misconceptions about the Keys is like tons of beaches. Everyone kind of envisions that, but really small beaches, pretty rocky beaches for most Yeah. It's uh, nothing like Fort Lauderdale. Nothing like Fort Lauderdale, <laughs> Miami area beaches. I think a good way of describing the beaches here in the Keys is that it's very similar to a, like a beach at a lake or something like that. Yeah. It's yeah. gonna feel the same. There's gonna be pretty much zero waves. There's lots of mangroves around here. The water isn't like the bluest right off the Keys, but as you go further out, then it gets really blue and beautiful. Before we talk any more about the Keys, I mean, I gotta point out, I know Brittany already did, but check I out the swimsuit. I told already told you guys about my swimsuit. It is really cute. And I have to say, I'm really impressed with the quality of it. It's so oh, soft. Oh, the quality's great. It's, it's so really soft, soft. yeah, and it it's fits great. Comfy. I love like the neckline and everything, so <laughs> stay tuned. I know, stay tuned guys. We're actually really, really excited. We're gonna be creating some really cool stuff. Hi, and Bella out here snorkeling. The water's super clear, so supposedly, there's a trench right kind of past them and there's a huge drop off. So right here is really shallow, but then it drops off, gets really deep, and then out where that white buoy is, 
Nick was telling us is a Spanish shipwreck that was here a long time ago, but there's still pieces of it and like an anchor and stuff. He did see a big tarpon fish come by, which is really cool. But we're letting the kids have a turn and then I think Jared's gonna go out and see what he can see. All right guys, I am going out there now with Bella. She's getting so good at this, she's so adventurous. I feel like she's gonna show me up now. <laughs> but hopefully we're gonna capture some good stuff here. <gasps> guys we just finished up some snorkeling and I gotta say Bella is amazing at snorkeling like it's very very impressive how good she is to the point that it exhausted me and I have to just now lay here and try to catch my breath <laughs> while they were swimming my cute sister took me some pictures of the swimsuit for those of you that do not know it to me is an amazing amazing photographer she's been doing it for years <laughs> She's good, you guys. She's really good. She's good. She actually took our wedding photos. So yeah. If you've seen any of our wedding photos, that is all Tiffany. Make sure you are following her over on Instagram to see all the amazing photos she captures. We will put her handle right here, but honestly, can't thank her enough. That was so fun. I mean, look at that background. It looks Beautiful. awesome. Speaking of a sick background, check out this new phone case. Here this how awesome is that that's really cool so check it out we got the JB logo up top we got the palm tree the sunset and a little bird Isn't that so cool? I, mean, <laughs> I know it looks good <laughs> I take a phone call with you any day <laughs> your chariot awaits. oh my gosh <laughs> where to where to my lady to live it, babe. But first, Jared is gonna take up the drone. The sun is starting to set. We're gonna try and follow us in the convertible. Now the wind is really strong, but I'm hoping I can get some cool shots, yeah. at least one or two. I mean, we have to, right? We're in the keys. Guys, this is awesome. I seriously think we need to get one of these oh my cars just for the vlog, it right? You know, just for the vlog. I love his excuse, just for the vlog. <laughs> Honestly though, ever since I have met Jared, he has wanted a convertible for so long and I've always said no. We've always lived in Utah and I've always said no, no, it doesn't make sense. Yeah, I know. Who knows? We will see. We're not looking makes anytime sense right soon. Now, right? But this is fun for the day to just take it out on an adventure. It just makes the experience. Like oh, just course, driving yeah. around, even when you're in traffic, it's still like fun because oh. you just have to Roof make, down. It is makes awesome. it a thousand times better. Yeah. And like when you guys go on vacation anywhere, especially somewhere tropical, we highly recommend renting one of these because at least for a day. Just at least for one day. day. Yeah. At least for one day. Yeah. Because whenever Brittany and I do, we at least do it for at least one day. Yeah. And it's always been so incredible. It's worth the experience. Like everything just feels in better and cooler with a convertible. Yeah. And check out Turo, you guys. This was like eighty dollars for the entire day. Which, which is a steal because like awesome. Hertz or something like that was way more. Yeah. Expensive. Be a lot more. It was so simple to pick it up. Anyway, today has been awesome. Oh, it's been incredible. <laughs> Seriously, like this whole experience from start to finish, from being surprised with this car, like this is my dream car. I love Mustangs. <laughs> I love them, especially convertibles. I just call them Mustang Sally. Every time we go on a drive anywhere and rent one of these, it's Mustang Sally. When we were dating, we actually took a trip to San Diego. We yeah. rented our first Mustang. Yep. It was white. Yep. We'll have to see if we can find the picture. It was during the 4th of July. We put like an American flag beach towel out. Yep. And we named her Mustang Sally that trip, and it is so. We fun. posted it on Instagram. I'm we pretty did. sure that Brittany actually got a comment from Ford. Oh yes, that is right. I forgot about that. And yeah. they were like awesome picture or something like that. That was literally probably seven, eight years yeah. ago, which is crazy. Yeah, Ford but. actually commented on the photo. Well, you guys, you know what can we say? Ford, sponsor us. Please, just, yeah. can we have one? In our dreams. <laughs> 